Today's support comes from Summit Ministries, equipping teens to embrace God's truth. Online conferences prepare students to face the culture with a faith that stands strong. Visit our website today. Good morning. It's Monday, June 7th. Summer's here and you may be off, but World Watch will be broadcasting every weekday. So do make sure that you tune in and while you're at it, make sure you like and subscribe below. Well, on today's full World Watch, everyone's heard of El Nino when talking about the weather, but there's a La Nina too. We'll show you how it affects the climate around the world. And will you be able to break the speed of sound while flying to your vacation destination? Now, this is Top Story. 128 baby bobtail squid will spend their lives in space. The day after they hatched, they were on their way to the International Space Station and they'll be given their short lives for science, for the health of future astronauts. One of the things that happens to astronauts when they're in space is that their immune systems can become compromised or dysregulated. The little cephalods will return to Earth frozen to be studied. Squid have almost similar immune systems as we do, humans do. They weren't the only passengers. The cargo included 5,000 microscopic organisms known as water bears. Tardigrades survive extreme radiation, sizzling heat, extreme cold, and decades without food. And for the sake of humans in extreme environments like space, scientists want to know how. Find out more about our full daily show at worldwatch.news. Get a subscription to the full program or join our email list. And remember, whatever the news, the purpose of the Lord will stand.